mini portable projector like this truly make bin watch section much more comfy. But they might have a major downside. That's it, Netflix may be not included. In today's video, I'll share with you guys three easy ways to set up Netflix into portable projectors. Before getting started, make sure you have given it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button for more tips and tricks. All right, let's get to the video. Let's kick things off. It's no surprise to see Netflix pre-installed on most smart projectors now. Seems like it's a streaming standard, right? However, if you can't find Netflix on the home screen or in the Play Store, it likely means the developer doesn't support it. At Jimmy Tex had actually talked about this exact problem with Netflix on X, or so-called Twitter. It even guide others to get Netflix on X TV Manager as the temporary solution. But it seems like kind of long time ago. Anyway, to this point, all we gotta know is Netflix might not be officially available on certain portable projectors, but there's a workaround. We can access it through third-party apps or devices. All right, we're gonna get to the fourth option, that is to install an app letting us operate and access other apps not listed in the projector app store. Here, I'm gonna use desktop managers. Simply go to the Play Store on the XGME projector, download and open the app. If you're watching this video on your projector, you can get the link in the comment section. After that, we'll get into the desktop manager home screen. Netflix appears at a recommended option on the home screen. Click to download it. The APK file will then be on your projector. Click on Netflix again to access the file folder and open the APK file. Choose install. Once it's installed, then open the app. Just log in and use Netflix as usual. Next, you might see a message from the app saying unable to extract something down there. All you need to do is wait and then select the switch option. After that, re-enter Netflix from the desktop manager. This time, the APK will process once more, leading you directly to the actual login screen, just like this. The next solution is connecting to a streaming device. Netflix now is totally accessed easily from any streaming device. It could be either Roku, Fire Stick, or Apple TV. First, power up the projector and the streaming device. Here, I'm using a Fire Stick. Then, we're gonna connect the stick to the projector's SDMI. So the moment the Fire Stick is launched, things get much more familiar, right? And even though the projector is indeed smart, it's still great as simply displaying Netflix from the streaming device. The last option may sound a little off base, but still gets the job done. So I'm keen to let you in on it. Plus, it also somehow answers the question of black screens when casting Netflix on a longer screen. The issue is all about copyright protection, but I've got to walk around for your Windows laptop. The easiest solution is to connect your laptop to the projector via HDMI. After that, just open the Netflix website on your laptop browser. It's a straightforward process. If you want a clean and wireless casting setup, here's another way. First up, let's open Netflix website on your web browser. We're gonna head to the kebab menu, save and share, and select cast. Then, click on the projector's name from the list. Wait for a process to be done. And yup, we're all set. Alright everyone, that's it for today's video. Thanks for tuning in. Catch you in the next video.